I know, uh, normally the living, uh, like my own when I was born, um, not being Lou and Linda, because they never wanted to talk about this kind of stuff, but like the interested parties, like my Aunt Judy, my grandmother Mariah, uh, my Aunt Marie would sit and listen. She's like, I don't know how interested I am. She's like, but I find you entertaining. Right, okay, and then Uncle Stevie would come in, right, uh, and Cliffy, like, was not, like, he found me really cute, and so that's why he listened, and, but he wasn't having any part of it at first, with the alien talk, but then he started having friends, and then it was like, uh, you might be on to something, right, thanks for that uh, vote of confidence, birthday bud, all right, so, um, and actually, bud, B-U-D, like Budweiser, like the beer, right? That was my grandfather. I would be his rosebud, R-O-S-E, B-U-D. Um, I was what came after, which he was trying to make nicer than when he left it. Um, but anyway, so um, there's something called a resident alien. Now, see this funny thing? This is representative of my baluster born I mate, I M A T E. Um, he is like the square at the shoulders. He's like straight across and then it comes in and he's like the awning, A W N I N G, that towers over me. That makes me feel small but yet secure. Only thing on this planet that ever makes me feel small and secure is him. Other than that, I will be as big, loud, obnoxious as ever, or I will just be quiet and slip in and out. You'll never even know I'm there. <sighs> so, uh, there's, see, there's something called a Sith. Like, I think uh, Palpatine, right, yeah, problem with you all is because you never heard of these things. You think, like, a Sith is, like, something really important. Yeah, don't get excited. It's a skin... It has an ID, either toe tag, uh, dog tag, something put in its mouth or around its toe when it dies. Um, and so for us in Morgan, whatever, coroner's office and paperwork. Uh, all right. And then there is the TH, which again is a Planck's constant, but that's a high psi like principle, so whatever, we don't get into too crazy with that, uh, right, and then it is the, what did I put, unit, so the Sith is the unit inside the frame of reference for the resident alien, that's it, so how do you get the two of us extra specials, no, oh wait, right, resident, the reason why I put alien instead of authority is because there's one line that him and I are both delivered to, Look at that. And then each one of the tops, because we have to split, because we split into two, one male, one female. Look at that. It has like a little hat on the top of like the N. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. All right, so now uh, you invoked, right? People say invoked. They're like, whoa, invoked the spirits? Uh, yeah, here's the thing. Uh, system services, like the star system, the one that keeps the planet from drifting off too far from the sun and going into another district that, like, who turned off the lights? It got really cold and, yeah, or drifting too close to the sun. I don't know what, I mean, I know it's a gaseous whatever, but, I mean, if it was like a gas fireplace, you don't want to get too close to it because then you burn the living and that would not be good, right? I mean, right, so there's like a system that controls that and says, alerts the humans in charge and goes, oh, guys, <laughs> yeah, drifting a little too far over here, a little too far over here, oh, boy. Yeah, and that's where it gets dangerous with you, like science junkies and the family being out of sorts and then inviting new friends to dinner in a restaurant you don't own. <laughs> yeah, okay, so um, then we've got Invoke over here. Now here's the thing. See this E? I did it down here. It's looking in the opposite direction, going that way, right? And then coming back this way. Uh, it kind of picks up on like, okay, if we're doing trajectory, by the time the sector vector gets over to this one in this synth 
or this Reich. I mean, I like the word Reich just because it makes sense on the rotation of things, but yeah, I know you guys and your Germans don't like to... Although it's funny because germ is what controls disease in a long-term effect. So I thought you'd like us a little bit more in trying to explain something to you and like angry folks that need a little cattle prodding. Anyway, so then you've got, let's see, what is this? Uh, I think of Nevada. Oh, right. Yeah, Nevada State. I think you, we put something special there. A secret, quiet, like, I don't know, alien stuff that we don't talk about because you guys are, like, religious or you don't believe it or you do believe it and then we don't want you in getting in a whatever. Okay, so then there's the okay. So now here's the world as the O and then there's the look towards the future, like that direction. Great, that's a sigma directional on the okay. Like, I'm trying to follow you. Build me a reality. Like, get to you the point. You know, it's like a lot of people come up and they'll talk to me. They'll be like, so, uh, I heard that you and your dad went here. I'm like, yeah, okay. No, it's just, like, I'm not agreeing that I enjoyed myself. There was no enjoyment. The facts were stated by the mannequin that spoke to me. And I'm just saying, okay, it happened. Now what? No, no, I just, did you enjoy it? Well, now you're going to ask me opinion stuff, and I know I don't like the guy. Is I don't know. What is the future on the K? Is it going to be a knockout? Like, they're going to have to knock something out, like, on the CDC list? If I tell you that, yeah, he took me to, I don't know, Mickey, he took me to McDonald's. We had a, a, a burger. Well, I didn't eat a burger because I don't eat cow, but I had chicken nuggets. Now, is that going to, like, what is that costing me on, like, you knowing things list of stupidity while I'm stuck in failure with my father? With the mannequin that doesn't work? Just curious. Um... So, the OK was sent to Cosmic Single for Comet. Uh, then you've got EDP. Oh, this is my favorite. Okay, N NYPD, the little local MITI police, they use EDP for the emotionally disturbed person. Yeah, that's what humans are <laughs> at manifestations. Why? Okay, so here's what happens. Um, you have an emotionally disturbed person now? Great. You know how we got one now? Well, somewhere in the recent past, there was a man who played a if, what, then scenario at university <laughs> and got his part wrong. Uh, usually it happens at Elizabeth's Sea of Tranquility that it caught on in Russia and then it went down to India. It's a real fucking mess. Um, it's like another epidemiological nightmare. Um, we don't have any of that in America, so you guys stayed stupid. Yeah, well, okay, so our numbers should be down on CDC effects. Okay, so now let's see. Um, so it's the man if I station at Union. You get the reps and the members. Oh, look at this one. The D is a unit, and then they stirred something up, like silt at the bottom, and then it made it all murky and really hard to do. Right, and then you, you're you in bed. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that, but the bed is not like a bed that you sleep in. It's like a bed that you die in, right? And then you hurt other people's families, and we put a bullseye on that between born and dead. This is what you did. Right? We do have, like, you know, management does get reports on which one of their employees Employees are not working out at unions and members and reps and things. That's why I really don't get why we are so broken in like big got area operations. With my failure at every 14,970 rotations, I've gotten up as a tour and been in the exact wrong spot, holding the only baluster that's going to make everybody sick in large quantum areas that you're all denying. But oh, it's going to happen. It's going to happen, and it was all your fault for knowing in advance who I am, who he is, as the only two resident aliens. You have us in a forked position. Your requirement as emergency management for planetary security is to bring us together. You've held me apart from him purposely for what reason? All area, dumb, fucking, and useless. I'm just curious. With the amount of management services we give you as the two resident aliens, 
at like quiet places, you get reports, you get who's working, who's being affected by EDP and, and manifestations. Why is this not fixing itself? Uh, Lewis, by the way, speaking of mental cases, Lewis Cataruza, the father I was born to, uh, that I was never to stay with, never to do a rotation with either at large impact. Uh, he is closing every one of his businesses. He calls it retiring. But here's the thing. It's the born unit uh, uh, said, it's kind of like the what transpired before, the I-ness being myself as the N, the ETA, in the SS emergency services got here, uh, usually Lewis's antenna will pick up on what the police need to know in big area ops. If it's saying worldwide corporate network, uh, guess where you got to go? Anybody try going directly to Argyle himself? He's got some socks. Like, I don't know, they're really important socks, right? And like, it's for the socket between the lipids that have too much and then the hip joint in it's a two-legged project, one in front of the other. If one of the hips isn't working in a hinge, like back and forth, <laughs> it is just never going to work for you humans to get anything fixed right. What do you where do you think you go next? Because there is no next. It, we are the resident aliens. He and I don't go anywhere. We just closed down your shop and all life in it and all life sustaining everything. And then we recreate in a more hospitable environment with living creatures that appreciate us and take care of us.